What's up everybody? Welcome back to another video. My name is Nord Trades and today I bring you another special video. So we're going to be doing a play of the day with Isaac. Hi Isaac, how are you? What's going on? I'm good, how are you? Good, good. Alright, so we have Isaac over here uh, and he'll be talking about his plays for the day. I think he made a little over $1,000. How much did you make today, Isaac? And like 1,000 with commissions. Cool. 1,000. You're still on TOS? Yeah, yeah. I need to make the switch to IV, but I'm still on TOS. All right, cool. We'll, we'll probably get you on that wave soon. So, uh, we had a pretty decent day. There was a bunch of things going on. We had the morning momentum, and then uh, I remember catching some downward plays at the end of the, the day. We had the, I had the Tesla puts, and I had the Amazon puts. But in the morning, we had some, you know, crazy upside for one netflix had a crazy uh push but that ended up dying so we're gonna give it up to isaac here he's gonna talk about his plays of the day or play of the day uh and talk about how uh he came up and made a thousand dollars today so let's let's get it isaac yeah so um i was watching netflix if you look on the one hour chart you can see it's been consolidating between 515 and like 500 so this was like due for a breakout pretty soon and it has a gap on the one year. You pull it up. Here you can see the gap goes from 515 all the way to about like 546. So this one's been on my watch list for a while, seeing if I could catch the breakout move. <clears throat> so today it was on watch because it was close to the 515 level in pre-market. Mm -hmm. I just kind of had it on my radar. You were looking at the consolidation on what on what chart? The one hour? Um, yeah, the one hour. All right, cool. You have it on your screen? I have it on my yeah, screen. Yeah. All right, cool. But yeah, the one hour. So yeah, I, had, I was watching that, and on Friday, it like broke 500, but wicked back up, so it never like really broke out of the consolidation. Mm -hmm. So today, I was watching it, and it's sold off in the morning and then started recovering but as it started recovering it started getting closer to the 515 level and i was watching nq as well and nq is kind of well netflix doesn't follow nq as much but nq wasn't showing like crazy signs of selling off or anything like that so i was watching it here at 714 and it had a huge candle up to the 515 level decent volume and that's when I entered 10 contracts okay so you entered before the 515 like what, what number do you think you entered uh the five the, the Netflix play let me let me see yeah you can show your fills too if you want on the video yeah all right so at 714 my time so that's yeah that's this big green candle here um, I entered 10 contracts. I filled market because it was pushing up and I was, it was a little before the 515 break. Mm -hmm. So it was probably around like 514.90 or around before the 515. Okay. So I entered 10 contracts market filled because I saw it pushing and it was pushing with decent size volume. So I got in 10 contracts and then it broke 515, broke 516 and it closed above, uh, 515 which is a bullish sign and then my sell was at 715 okay so on the next candle since i was up decently i didn't i had room to 520 ish okay i was up decently and yesterday uh or not yesterday last week i had a decent red week so i just kind of wanted to be conservative and just take my profits pretty quickly mm -hmm. so yeah i sold on the second candle filled and took my profit there. So what what number was that like on Netflix around what what uh um like around five sixteen fifty. Okay. Yeah, so that was like a dollar fifty push. Yeah, but those premiums on Netflix yeah. flipped very crazy. So what did you end up pulling percentage wise on that uh on that play? Do you know? Um, let me see. So I put in six grand, like around six point two K came out for him. I pull up the calculator, hold up. Um, six. So you made one just on Netflix today? Yeah, I made 1K. So 
I started the day down 320 because I swung Tesla. Hmm. I swung Tesla call. That, were you following the, uh, did you follow the, the option clue that came in, the big, that big order that came in on Friday? Yeah, I mean, I followed it, but I bought next week's, uh, Oh, okay. Call. Yeah, I saw that order come in, too. Yeah, so I thought, I just, yeah, it was just one contract, so I just followed it. Mm-hmm. And then that Netflix play took you to positive what, like seven hundred for the day? Um, positive like, mm, yeah, like seven eight hundred. Cause in the morning I did trade Tesla. Um, I can show that too. It was a day trade. Yeah, it was a day trade. All right, cool. Yeah, on the Netflix trade, I made about like 17%, almost 20%. And then, yeah, I'll show the Tesla trade I took in the morning. Cool. Yeah, Netflix had a nice move, but it came back into consolidation yeah. on the one hour. Yeah, it dropped back into consolidation, so that still potential play. For the yeah, definitely. Good test. So I played Tesla, so I was watching it in the morning because I'd swung it. Mm -hmm. I was looking for the 710 break room to like 715, 720. But right off the open, it just started selling off. So, so what'd you do? You caught puts or calls? Caught calls. So I was watching it as it was, it was dropping. So I was kind of waiting for a bounce. And I got in at the 701 candle. Okay. You can see it, it dropped, it bounced, it came back down, and it made a higher low. And then it just had a crazy uh, candle with 117 volume, K volume. Yeah. So that that was, NQ was pushing. So that, to me, it was a, a sign of, like, a, a bullish move. So then I traded this lightly. I didn't go in with my normal size. I went in five contracts. Okay. And then I sold. I sold pretty early, just because again I was trying to play it safe and not hold things longer than. How much did it bounce? I wanted. Um, it bounced from I got in at six ninety four, like eighty, and then it pushed all the way up to six ninety six, uh, like six ninety six forty forty six ninety six thirty area. Yeah. And that's when I sold. So it was just a quick trade for me. Yeah, sounds like a little um, risky play there. <laughs> yeah. And it, I don't know, it was all, like Tesla likes to sell off and have these bounce and it was showing like a W type of recovery. Okay. So I just, I, I took that trade there. Okay. And then sold and then, it, yeah, so that was um, that one. And so then I was down like around, I made 160 bucks on that. So I was down like around like uh, 200. And then you had, you had the Netflix trade after? Yeah, and then I had a Netflix straight after, and that's what brought me up to around like one k, and then I made a few other scalps here and there. All right, the cool. Netflix trade was my the biggest trade. Today. Yeah, it so sounds like it. So it was around like what twenty percent you said? Yeah, like seventeen. Cool. All right, that was nice. That's a nice little trade. I saw that this morning. I even played it myself too. So I like that five. I, I think I had it on Twitter too. I looked at the five fifteen. I got in after you because I waited for a confirmation. So I think I, I was looking at the 515.50 level, but I ended up taking a small position at 515 and then added at 515.50. Uh, but I got in later than you, but I got out later than you too. So I got out at like 517.50 ish. So like a, a dollar after you. Yeah. But yeah, so th those are the highlights of your day. Uh, did you, you showed the fills, right? Yeah, I showed the fills right here. Cool. So yeah, nice. That's a play of the day with Isaac. He had that Netflix play, oh, 17%, cracking a little over a thousand for the day. Uh, we're gonna do a lot more of these where we see, you know, play of the day, or you know, even if someone has a red day, we're gonna try to do an interview and see why he took, you know, had a red day or a red play. You know, the play of the day or our bad play of the day. We'll have uh, a few of those maybe once a week, and then we'll do full-on interviews either with student of the month or uh, with students who are struggling or doing very well in the chat. So uh, it was great talking, you to, uh, talking to you, Isaac. Thank you for joining us today.
Hey, you too. Thanks for having me. Appreciate it. So make sure you guys hit that like button, subscribe, comment down below, below what other videos you would like to see on this channel, and we'll get that done for you guys. Peace.